Good day, everybody. I'm the Tyrant Fucking King, and welcome back to the Imperium. And today it's time for another grand strategy game game series. This time it's time to go back to an age of total war. It is time for Medieval 2 Total War, aka my favorite of the series to date. Yes, even more so than Warhammer 2. The Warhammer 2, we will get to there eventually, is my favorite of the modern iterations of the Total War franchise. This being my least, and for of Britannia being my least favorite and least played. Anyway, though it says 60 hours up here, I've actually more or less played 500 to about 1,000 in Medieval 2. I had it this before Steam, so what can you do? Anyway, let us get into the definitive edit, the original campaign, and I don't know who to play as. Yeah, no idea. All right, we don't need to see this. I have loved justice and hate inequality, and therefore I die in exile. All right, who to play as? Should I play as England? Scotland is a nice one to play. Alright, since for my European Universalis, I'm doing France. For Medieval 2, I'll be doing the Free Lions themselves. England. Having recently wrested, wrestled control of England from the Saxons, many would expect the conquering Normans to be somewhat spent and weakened. However, the new rulers of England have swiftly replaced and improved the taxation system so as to replenish their coffers in quick time. But most importantly, William the Conqueror came with some from them. I should owe so bloody. Audio settings. Yeah, sorry. Oh, subtitles in two. Sorry about that. I will not read out the. Alright, blah, blah, blah. I'm not gonna read all that, fuck that. Let's actually um, go into the campaign. The strengths of the English, they both superb longbowmen and strong infantry, though, field a poor variety of cavalry. With the Norman conquest and a crowned king came the dawning of a new era for England. Nobles ordered the construction of mighty castles to fortify the realm. To rule this land is a birthright, but to control it requires the courage and skill few possess. It is a kingdom beset by enemies. The Scots press at its borders, the Vikings to the north, and the French separated by a mere channel of water. All of the country exists in a state of war, as even the common are called upon for duty. times of total war, it rests on the shoulders of those who lead to ensure the kingdom does not fall into ruin. Alright. Alas, how many noble and valiant knights we lost. Vulture of, Ch of Chatres. Anyway, we're playing as England and we will want to take York as quick as possible. Let's have a look. You gonna tell me how much it's worth you? Oh wait, that, that, that that's a spy. Do I have a merchant? Yes, I do. At your service. All right, all right. Dies aren't that expensive. What about silk? 
Journeying onward. As you command. Let's do it. So my lord. Mm-hmm. That army is piss. Orders. Sire. Let's go to piss and I'll just go here. Yeah, yeah, go over there. To battle it is then, sire. My lord. Orders. Do that. To war then, sire. Prepare to us, my king. Sire. Let's get all of London out. I've tried whipping them, sire. With the oh, men them out. Combining forces, sire. Let's just get a simple town militia. And just peasants here. Alright. We want to expand quickly, so let's actually get some land clearance to get our population up. This early game strategy: get some, get farms, and maybe some roads. Yes. All right. Now there's a Welsh province here. over here and Dublin's over here. We want to take out the Scots very quickly, as well. They'll prove to be a threat late game. We also want to. They prove to be a threat early game. We also want to take out France as their late game armies will be destructive. Mid game armies are dominated by the Holy Roman Empire as well as Denmark if they get it going. Spain isn't too much of an issue, neither is Portugal. The Moors, not really. Egypt, not really. But the Seljuks, late game are a nightmare. Anyway, let's actually get into this. I am playing on medium difficulty, by the way. I just want a fun campaign. In future, we might go to very hard, but we're going to do a fun campaign instead of a very difficult one. Because even then, it's still quite difficult. Anyway, let's also get London's population up to very high tax. I mean, to high taxes, so we can get more money. And um, yes, your highness. Let's also go back to London without priest. Let's also get our um, discretion, sire. Where to, sire? I am watching from the shadows. Shit. Sire. Okay, let's end turn. Rene. Okay, good. I'm actually Order. going to Rene. To battle it is then, sire. Let's get two of them. Yes, sire. Besieging the enemy. Command me, sire. I want Paravanon. They'd never been born, my lord. I should have actually attacked. Then, let's actually fight the battle. Fight this battle. I shall lead our forces into battle, my lord. Understood, General. A safe stronghold, our god is still. A trusted shield and weapon, Martin Luther. I say the general speech. Heard men speak well of me because I do not throw lives away needlessly, and I gain victory for those who follow me. I will not use false modesty and deny these things. Indeed, I say proudly that they are true. I will give you victory if you have the guts to fight like devils when I ask it. These rebellious knaves and villains are not fit to breathe the same air as we honest Englishmen. They must all die before dawn comes again. This is a mercy, because they richly deserve the gallows for turning against their betters. And so, make your peace with God and any rivals in our ranks, and set your heart on what is to come. Go with God, men! Raise our banners! Alright, um, where is the best way to attack? I'm gonna go attack here, so let's get both our archers into a group. Over here, get our spearmen over here, and our general here. Let's start the battle.
here. General. Go over there. Alright. We want as little casualties as possible. We'll use our archers to basically whittle down the rebel forces. So we don't lose as many troops as I would like. We have to get more troops up north to take Edinburgh. Because the Scots will be quite relentless. Let's just fast forward the battle scene. How long must it take archers? Oh, that's it. Oh, there. Fine. Let's just go back. I should have looked at his name. Anyway, this battle will be won't be too difficult. Oh. It's not just a fool. Let's attack them. Alrighty then. The archers will just get shot. Alright. Alright, let's attack them while they're on the running back. This is actually weak, weak spear militia, so. Winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy.
let's see if this trying to work. Oh no, they're actually formed. This might be bad. They're not pikemen, so it could not be bad. Our men are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. That might not be my best move. Alright, they're not set. This could be good. Why? You just stop there. Are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. Our men are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. This battle is taking longer than I would like. Should have engaged them sooner. Charge. is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Come on, die, die, die. George, our men have slain the enemy general. I said to George, the troops will lose their will to fight. That is George who will give us victory here. All right, and Captain Edmund, run them down. Yes, the general is actually killing him. After this battle, I will end the video. It went longer than I would have wanted.
All right, we'll set up our troops for the final attack. Very much All in right, our this favor. Should be the if final we remain charge. true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Checking on the flank. There they come. Perfect. My lord, Perfect our charge. Men are in command of the city. Perfect charge. That's what I wanted. That should bring victory. I lost too many men in that battle. That was too easy a battle, but I did get. Shit troops, to be fair. Spear militia, are you fucking kidding me? All of me? Christendom will be awed by the victory we have won here today. Um, I can accept that, but I rather have only lost 38 there. Normally with my playthroughs as the Byzantines or like, even Scotland I lose very little. Such is the fate of all who Sack oppose settlement. us. The settlement has fallen. Build that. Take the spoils of war. Prince Rufus. This is our faction here. Imagine if he died. An order. This is King William. He'll be dead. Orders. And this is just Robert. Just I'm gonna call him Bob. All right. My king. That should be all that we're doing today. Actually, um, let's get some knights. Let's get some cavalry in. And that should be it for today. Not a very long video. Yeah, have a lot. We'll be calling this... The Lion Roars. Yep, that'll do. The Lion Roars. Quit the game. I don't want very long videos with Total War, and I want to do less with EU4 as well. But hopefully this will be this will be about the length of every video, about 25 minutes, depending, give or take a few minutes, depending on how long a battle takes. Like, that battle took longer than I would have wanted, but what can you do? Anyway, please like and subscribe to the channel, and always remember... Ah, oh, crap. I literally was thinking of Cadicorus there. Anyway, always remember to hail the Imperium.